Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to day 45 of the God Hears Her devotional. This morning's passage is in Galatians chapter 6, verses 1 through 10. So if y'all are ready, let's get started. And the word says, Brothers and sisters, if someone is caught in sin, in a sin, you who live by the Spirit should restore that person gently. But watch yourselves, or you also may be tempted. Carry each other's burdens, and in this way you will, will fulfill the law of Christ. If anyone thinks they are something when they are not, they deceive themselves. Each one should test their own actions. They can take pride in themselves alone without comparing themselves to someone else. For each one should carry their own load. Nevertheless, the one who receives instruction and the word should share all good things with their instructor. Do not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. A man reaps what he sows. Whoever sows to please their faith from the flesh will reap destruction. Whoever sows to please the spirit from the spirit will reap eternal life. Let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up. Therefore, as we have opportunity, let us do good to all people, especially to those who belong to the family of believers. One second while I prepare the scripture summary, please. Our scripture summary this morning comes to us from Galatians chapter 6, verse 4. I wrote down, Stop being in competition with yourself. The Christian walk is hard enough. Take time to learn to be happy. Um, now, I know that in different levels of businesses, um, you're always trying to better yourself and reach the goal faster and faster and faster. Well, what I learned this morning is to stop um, comparing my Christian walk to others because it looks very different in my world than it does to other people. In my world, things um, things are slower and more simplified and watered down because that's my reality. My reality is still the real world, but it's boiled down into simpler terms that I can understand. Now, in most people's real world, things get thrown at them left, right, and center every five seconds of every day. In my real world, things are not as fast paced and that's how that's how things 
work for me. Things don't always need to be fast paced in the world of Christianity either. Things take time and patience and growth. So if you're not where you wanna be, that's fine. It just means that you need to lean on God more for each and every goal to be hit in his timing and not yours. That's all the time that we have for today's devotional. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you guys on Monday morning. Bye everybody. Have a blessed and safe weekend.